If a file or folder is seemingly haunting your Windows PC, here's how to delete it for good. Firstly, force delete the problematic file or folder by copying your file name. Then open command prompt with admin rights. Type cd. Press the space bar. Paste the folder path. And then press enter. Like for an example, here's what your command should look like. Now to delete the target folder, type in the following command and replace the new documents with the name of your target folder. Then just press enter to continue. From there, your file or folder will be deleted and then restart your PC to apply the changes. Now another possible solution is to take ownership of the file or folder before deleting it. To do it, open File Explorer, click View, and show to open more Explorer options, select hidden items from the menu, bring up the file or folder path, right-click on it, choose Properties, select Security tab, then click Advanced to view the security settings for Windows app window, then click on Change, enter Administrator in the object name box, press Check Names, then click OK. After that, click the Replace Owner on the Subcontainers and Objects checkbox to select it. Then select Apply and click OK to change the folder permissions as configured. Lastly, repair corrected recycled bin. To do it, open Command Prompt with Admin Rights, tap in the following command, press Enter, and this command will delete the recycled bin folder from the drive. Now the folder will be restored automatically upon system reboot. And those are the following ways on how you can fix a reappearing deleted file or folder on your Windows computer. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.